Uh, so what the USO has done, and it's done for decades and decades, is it, it travels the world and it, it reaches out and brings a little bit of home uh, to people around the world, uh, to the servicemen and women who serve. And, you know, COVID has been tough on all of us. And right now we still can't travel overseas. And since we can't travel overseas, uh, we looked around and we reached out to the USO and we decided that what we'd do is we'd come to the big bases in America. We also did Guantanamo Bay, but we'd come to the big bases in America and reach out to the soldiers, sailors, airmen, marines, the guardians, the, the ones who serve, who have been going through this tough year and a half as well, and bring a little joy to them. I mean, so my wife Janet also served, and when she was enlisted and coming to San Antonio, Texas, her father, who was also an airman, told her, hey baby, if you get into any troubles, don't worry about it, just go to the USO and they will help you out. I mean, that is the reputation that this organization has when it comes to helping our people, and it is global and they never stop. They work around the clock and you, you can always find a place where you can feel like you're at home.